Hi, as part of the next major release of uh, the slide dynamic PowerPoint add-in, we've um, made the process of changing the trigger icon, which launches the menu a little more elegant. Here's a standard presentation that I've already applied the menu to. And as you can see, it's the small gray default box with menu written on it, which isn't inspiring and doesn't really appeal to everyone. Um, but it works, and you can click it and bring up the menu and obviously navigate to a slide. So let me uh, just close that down for a minute and show you how we can quickly change that. Um, so go to the Slide Dynamic tab on the uh, PowerPoint ribbon menu. You see two new icons, the Choose Template and the Create Trigger button. So Choose Template literally takes you to all the template files. And I'm just using the two standard ones, but the first thing to do is, um, is just make a copy and name it as you um, uh, as you wish, and open it, and you'll see the the actual template itself, and just open that and ignore the the text here. That's fine. Um, so you can see the offending uh, icon in this case. So first thing we do is delete it. Um, actually, anything can form um, the trigger icon. So it can be a shape, a color any whatever you, you you really prefer I'm just going to use in this example um, just install implement a picture a graphic so this can be again anything that PowerPoint supports so I'll just uh, resize it and put it somewhere different just to emphasize the point um, once we've put the target item in that we're going to use as the trigger icon um, you just click it make sure it's highlighted go back to the slide dynamic add-in and uh, you guessed it, click the trigger button, and that basically um, makes sure that that is now recognized as the uh, the item that's going to launch the menu. So click OK. Make sure you click Save or all your work's wasted. And then close it down. And then we'll just go back to the menu where we wanted to, uh, to change this. And this template is now available. Uh, in the future for any new presentation you create. So we don't actually need to delete the template. It does it automatically. Just go Add Template. You'll see this is the new one that we chose. Uh, click it. Uh, there we can see. Just to confirm, that's the icon we're going to use to launch the menu. Hit Select, and this will basically replace the uh, the trigger icon in this case, which is the, uh, the gray square with this new shiny round trigger. So now that's all done, uh, we can just save it. We need to go through this uh, process just to initialize the menu. Uh, click Close, and then just reopen. Once that's done, just hit F5, and you can now see on any slide, although it wasn't well positioned in this case, but you can see just to launch it, you can go and click on it on any slide. And all is cool. So. That's how you um, change the icon in the uh, the templates. And it literally can be anything, whether it's uh, an imported graphic or uh, a smart shape or what have you. Um, thanks very much.